It's exciting. I mean, I've spent you know, most of my life living in London and uh, I think the most difficult thing about shooting in London is to try and find a way of shooting it that it's not a particularly photogenic city and to give it a mood and atmosphere and a sense of threat or a sense of personality um, because it's such a varied city. That's been a challenge. We had to, we were going to shoot in London. We had to see parts of London we hadn't seen before and also use the iconography, well, probably more than so than you would be able to do in most movies because Bond opens a few doors, so we got the chance to close down Whitehall. We've used the London Underground and close down tube stations and things. I think it's very exciting if you actually do go out and, uh, in, you know, in places, and places that, that are the real thing. We tend to shoot in the more expected areas, but I hope in unexpected ways and from unexpected angles. So we are in Whitehall and we are on Vauxhall Bridge and on the embankment and at Smithfield Market and all those sorts of things. But to me, it's just about how you look at the place. And I think in that respect, it's useful to be a, a Londoner. Sam and I wanted to make it British, and it's not some flag-waving thing that either one of us is interested in. It's just about basing Bond in Britain. And it's very exciting just to get out onto the streets and show London for what it is. We've made it look very beautiful and very dark and sinister at times, and, but it's Bond's home.